Hey guys, in the last tutorial, we have created this login and sign up activity and we have also created a contact class and database helper class and we have created the constructor on create and on upgrade methods. Now we'll add insert a contact method and search contact method. I'll go to signup.java. So when you click on the sign up button, now it is just checking if the passwords match or not but now we need to insert the details in the database so we'll do that so open signup.java and here if passwords are not matching then it will show the error else we'll create we'll insert the details in database this is just a comment so we'll need to create a contact object so write contact c is equal to new contact so this is how you create a new object and we'll set values of name email password and everything so write c dot name equal to sorry c dot set name and here we'll pass name string that is name str then c dot set email email str then c dot set uname uname str c dot set pass and pass one str or pass to str both will be equal so it doesn't matter Actually, we don't need ID here, so I'll just remove it. And I'll also remove these two methods from the contact class. Back to signup.java. So after doing that, we'll create a method insert contact. And we are going to use database helper here. So we'll create object of that class here. So write database helper. The hand I'll write helper equals new database helper and we need to pass the context you can write this here and we are going to use that here so write helper dot insert contact we are going to create this method so right now it is showing that that is there is an error so go to database helper now we'll create that method now so write public void insert contact so now if we check uh, the sign up java this error will be gone this method will take a contact object so contact c we need to pass this object here like this and now for inserting anything into the database we need to make it writable so you can do it like this db equals this dot get writable database and after that we need to create content values values equals new content values and I'll just hit alt enter to resolve this error it will get imported write values dot put and here it takes two uh, parameters string key and string value or byte value whatever so the key name will be column name and value will be c dot get name then same will be applied for email id so it will be column email and c dot get email 
values dot put column u name c dot get u name then values values dot put column pass comma c dot get pass like this now we need to insert it so write db dot insert and it takes a string table that is the table name then it will be null and content values so it will be table name is table name comma null comma content values that is values so this will insert this will insert the contact object into the database now our insert method is done now we'll create search method so we'll write before that we'll go to main activity when we are clicking on login button it is just opening this intent but first it needs to check if the username and password are matching or not we'll take the username and we'll also copy this one more time for password so here I'll just make it B and TF password and it will be pass B dot get text dot to string so now we have the username and password typed by the user so we'll we'll write helper dot search password and here we'll pass the username that is str here and it will return a string value so it will be string password equals this we need to make an object of database helper here also so write database helper helper equals new database helper and we'll pass this And we need to create search pass method so open database helper dot java i just finish this first so if you when you fetch this password we'll check if the password equals password and if they are equal then this will happen a new intent will start and it will show welcome username else it will show a toast message that the password and or the credentials are not matching so I'll just copy this toast and I'll paste it here so it will be toast pass toast I make it temp toast make text sign up dot this it will be main activity dot this passwords don't match it will be username and password don't match okay so this is done now we need to create search pass method so we'll go to database helper and we'll write public void search pass and it is taking the username so it will be string u name and it is returning a string value so it won't be the return type won't be void it will be string and inside this will write db equal to this dot 
get readable database now we are not writing anything into the database we are reading it so we need to do this and don't forget to close it here db dot close after everything is done and we'll write a query to fetch the values so write string query equals select star from or you can write select uname and password from date um, table name and now we'll make a cursor variable cursor cursor equal to cursor cursor db dot raw query and inside this we'll pass this query And we need to import this so i'll just hit alt enter it will get imported raw query and the second parameter will be null it takes two parameters it is giving one error okay we haven't returned anything so the error will be gone later don't worry about it now we'll write if cursor dot move to first then we'll write a do while loop so here we'll write we'll fetch the password and union so for that write string I'll declare it outside here I'll write string a comma b a will be username and b will be password so a equals cursor dot get string and here we need to write this so first will be the zeroth uh, index will be username and one index will be password and b equal to cursor dot get string and here one so this will be username and this will be password if a dot equals this username then we need to stop we need to store this password actually i'll just write it here so we'll store that password here and we'll write break so we don't need to check the next contact variables or objects and here we'll write cursor dot move to next here we need will assign b equal to not found so if it is not found it will just display this text and now we'll return this password so we'll return b so this is done now I'm I'm gonna stop here for today. There is an error in main activity class. Okay, it is gone now. The search error, search pass error is gone. So I'm gonna stop here for today. In the next tutorial, I'll do the remaining part and I'll also show the working of this application. So thank you for watching this video. Make sure to subscribe to my channel. And if you liked it, then make sure to hit the like button. Bye.